Good morning, Calvary. This is Pastor Mitch with your word for the day. And as I read through today's passage of Judas's betrayal, it reminded me of all the times that I had felt betrayed in my life. At school, when friends became enemies. At work, when trusted coworkers broke their word. And at home, when family members failed to live up to their responsibility. And and it made me so mad that Judas could betray Jesus that way. We find today's passage in in, uh, the Gospel of Mark, chapter 14, verses 10 through 11, and it reads, Then Judas Iscariot, who was one of the twelve, went to the chief priests in order to betray him to them. And when they heard it, they were glad and promised to give him money. And he sought an opportunity to betray him. See, he was Jesus' friend. Jesus trusted him to be a part of his inner circle. He traveled with Jesus, and he lived alongside him for years, And then Judas betrayed him. And it wasn't as if Jesus deserved it or that Judas was getting back at him for some wrongdoing. Judas betrayed Jesus, the son of God and the creator of the universe for just a little bit of gold. So in the more I contemplated what Judas had done, that Judas had simply given Jesus up for money, the more I disliked him, the more I disliked the situation and I felt the Holy Spirit begin to nudge me. And I realized that I am Judas, that I betray Jesus as well, that we all betray Jesus. See, each time we ignore God's command for financial gain, we choose money over Jesus. Each time we're too embarrassed to share Jesus with others, we choose comfort over Jesus. And each time we choose to justify our own wrongdoing, we choose our pride over Jesus. Pride, anger, jealousy, envy, fear, comfort, money. We so often choose so many other things over Jesus that sometimes we get blinded to those choices that we make. Calvary, today my challenge to you is to think about what it is in your life that you are choosing over Jesus. Think about what that is and make the decision today to put Jesus first. Today you can choose Jesus. My encouragement to you is to remember that despite your mess ups, Despite your failures, Jesus never stops choosing you. Thank you for tuning into your word for today. Uh, we'll see you tomorrow. Have a good day.